up, guys? It's your boy KJ. Today we're gonna be reacting to Camaro versus Soro Grand Beatbox Loop Station Battle 2017. This is the one fourth final, so we're gonna check it out. And uh, I'm excited, man. Loop Station has definitely been my favorite. Like my favorite as far as the the battles so far. Like it's just unique. I, I I'm a music head. I I love music, and so like the way how they do it, it's just so impressive, man. It blows me away every time. I say the twelve. You say the drum. The earth. It's By the way, a lot of guys who still wondering why I'm doing 2017, I'm doing this. I'm not doing every single video of 2017, but I'm just doing it to where I understand a little bit more about the beatbox culture. So, yeah, you know what I'm saying? This, this, it's only right. You know, why would I come in and just only do the newest popular videos? Like, no, it's like, go back and do, your, do some understanding of why and how we got to this point. Twat! By the way, before I continue, I've, I've noticed you guys really don't too much care about the tag team battles. I'm look, you know, I'm looking, I'm, I'm seeing a lot of you guys don't really too much care about the tag team battles. Perhaps maybe I just do the, the, uh, the final tag team battle, like the final one. But I'm doing loop station. I, I, I enjoy the loop station, so I'm gonna watch the loop stations regardless, and I'm gonna uh, react to them. But I noticed you guys don't really too much care about the tag team uh, as much as far as the other big battles. So, I mean, uh, let me guys, let me know in the comments. Do y'all want to see the tag teams? And uh, if if so, do you just want to see like the final and the small final? Because I'll just do those and then we can get straight to the later progression. And regardless, I'm going to still go through and watch some of these older things just to do them, learn. But... It's no point of making the videos if no one's gonna watch it. So that's all the reason why I ask. This is why I love the loose stations, bro. You could do some crazy stuff with it. And it sounds like a real track. It is. It's a real track. They compose and make the music right then and there. It just, bro, this is like, this straight up everything, bro. They are artists, true artists, bro. Like, to do something like this and then make, <laughs> who needs, who needs VSTs where you could do stuff like this? You don't even need instrument, uh, instrumental, like instruments, VSTs when you can do something like this. It's crazy. <laughs> Vos conseils, me teste à l'endroit comme à l'envers Me chuchote doucement à l'oreille J'ai le temps de divaguer vers des contrées éphémères Elle me suit dans des mondes parallèles Me rappelle qu'ici tous les cas artificiels Tombent dès lors que le soleil se lève Et que sa beauté peut nous laisser un goût à perdre Elle passe vite ou trop vite me Consomme autant qu'elle m'inspire seul Saisis couramment de mes tripes dures De furieux de buse aux atouts magnétiques J'aime le silence qu'elle me délivre La dépendance de pouvoir suivre L'influence de ses délires Je continue plus à part Je continue plus à part
Hold on. Yo. Hey, man. I've been waiting for a long time to be going back to the Loop, loop Station series, bro. I just can't explain it, bro. I, I make music. I produce. I'm an artist. I'm a, uh, I, I make rap music as well. And just like this, to see this. This is amazing, bro. That was nice. That was nice. Let's go. It is three minutes on Camaro. BBK is a that was a nice, nice one for Saro right there. That was nice. That's a that's a good way to start off. You want to you want to start off that round like that. That's how. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, let's right. see what let's see what Camaro got. I see the dry, you see the divide and the ice. Dry. Okay, I see what he's doing. I see what he's doing. He's just putting them in there and like a mixy melting pot, just putting the word, the the sounds in there. And he's like, I'm just gonna let y'all just be amazed once it come out. Like y'all just gonna he's doing the shock factor, he's building the anticipation up, but I see what he's doing. Okay, let's go ahead, let's go ahead. Oh God! Oh God! All right, yo, but you do something. Like you already know he's about to do something. Oh, he is this okay? All right, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. So I'm gonna be honest with you guys. If it's if it's like this, I don't know. You've already burned about a minute and 30 seconds. About a minute, at least a minute and 20 seconds, 15 seconds. I don't know where this is going. I don't know, but we're gonna see. Okay. I do like the going back to the original of like the NPCs, how you just, you know, using it as like an NPC kind of. I like that.
make some noise, everybody. I don't know. I I don't know what what was that. I don't yo like hey. First of all, I know he's prolific and good. I know for a fact, but this one, this gonna hurt. This round is definitely gonna hurt him. I can tell you that. Um, I don't know. I don't know what the hell was that. I don't know. But uh, we're gonna continue on to the next round. I think he got some on his sleeve. I think this might be a wild card. Maybe he wasn't expecting that first round to come on and hit hard. You know what I'm saying? Maybe this was like a lot. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know what happened. But that's not it, bro. That, that wasn't it. Everybody give it up for Camaro. Hey. But at the end of the day, man, these guys are still high professionals. Even Camaro. He's still high professional. There was, you know what I'm saying? Even that, that, that right he did, a lot of people can't do. You know what I'm saying? So, hey. It is now three minutes on Sorrow from Frack. Bro, Sorrow. This is like uh, that moment with Drake and Meek Mill. Like, uh, Drake, he did, he did, uh, he, you know, well, actually, it's not really, but it kind of is because, like, Drake sent out a little warm up and then Meek didn't respond. Drake gave him some time back and then he dropped this banger out of nowhere. Y'all know what I'm talking about. If you hear pop heads, y'all know what I'm talking about. We're gonna put the time up. You only get three seconds, barely. No, I'm just kidding. Three minutes on sorrow. I say the toi, you say the done, the uh, it toi. Yo, that bass line with the 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 trumpet uh instruments uh wind instrument that he's doing with it and kind of had it as like a, a melody. Okay. Bro, I swear, I could literally rap on these tracks that he's doing. Like, that's how crazy it is, man. This stuff sounds so good. Yeah, I, I really, I really want to see Camaro bring something to the table for the second round. I really hope Camaro do. I do not want it to be a default by win like that. No.
Wow. Yo, Sorrow is definitely is I can see where you guys talk about Sorrow so good. Like he is definitely a genius when it comes to loop stations. Like, gosh, Lee. Ooh, la, la. Look at her. Look at the ball. Look at the ball, bro. They they don't <laughs> Crazy, bro. It's crazy. Ooh, la, la. Now I was told to tell you before a second round, Camaro's gonna be doing this with no eyes, no mouth. This is Camaro's second round. No eyes, no mouth. So is he playing the like you know like how um like he's put on like uh like uh an act, right? It's like like maybe burning the first first round just like as a wild card and then like like what they call it like i don't know i'll, I'll come back to it give him some respect give him some respect i said the dry you said the dry nights it dry Okay. First of all, I will say this though. That is not easy to do when you got a blindfold in your mouth. When you're supposed to beatbox, but using your mouth and then the mouth to duct tape. Okay. Okay. I gotta give him some props for that. I gotta give him some props for that. That that's different. Everybody's on the edge right now trying to see what he's about to do, bro. You see that? Everybody on the edge trying to see what he's trying to do. What he's about to do. I'm sorry, man. I think uh, Saro won this, you know, easily won this, to be honest. Saro did definitely single-handedly won this easily. But, 
like I said, I don't know the situation. Maybe this is his first time ever playing into the loop station battles. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Maybe his preparation. Who knows? I don't know the circumstances of what happened. So I, you know, I can't base off of first time seeing and um seeing like Camaro in a battle like this. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I gotta be fair and keep an open mind for like later battles because it's probably just a bad battle it's probably just a bad battle for him you know what i'm saying and that's just how it is <laughs> I really don't know. I, 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 I've never seen any of these other battles, so I don't know how he got in here. I don't know how he got into this, into the, to the final, you know, compared to elimination. If they did, if they did solo elimination for loot battles, uh, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, but that, it wasn't it, man. I think, and like I said, I just think that he had a bad game. I think it was a bad, a bad battle for him. Just it happens, bro. It happens to the best. Even LeBron, even LeBron doesn't even perform every single day as well. So, you know what I'm saying? I've never seen that before. Make some noise for this battle. We got some. But I will say it was impressive that he. Did was able to create some stuff blindfolded with no senses of him being a C, nor able to really use his mouth as much. Uh, you know. Camaro versus Camaro, everybody, one more time. Give it up, give it up, give it up. Yo, what if like Camaro actually won that though? <laughs> what if Camaro actually won this? Who's moving on to the next round? Is it gonna be Camaro or Sorrow, everybody? You guys know what to do. Judges, in three! Sorry, when I say the three, y'all say the two and the one. I have to explain this one more time. Who's moving on? In three! Two, Give it up for Sorrow, every- I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Hey, I'm sorry, but like we, I think we all knew. I think we all knew. The judges, even Sorrow, the look on his face, he, he already knew. There, there was, I I didn't like it. I didn't like the fact that it was not a like I at least want to see one one battle where I'm like, yo, I don't know who won that but that round. Like I at least want to see one round where I'm like, I don't know who won that round. But hey, it's cool, it's cool, you know what I'm saying? Now every time you you're gonna be able to come through like that, you know. So hey, yo, if you guys enjoyed me, hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button. I'm gonna be dropping more regular beatboxing video reactions as well as other dope stuff. So be on the lookout for that. This is your boy Kedre. I am out. Peace.